Hello everyone, if you want to start streaming or do a YouTube video, then to download the OBS Studio, head on over to obsproject.com and select the select the operating software and right, you want to create a scene head on over to the site here and create a scene I've already created scene 2 which is empty so I'll show you there this will be a, a component of the scene 2 here you press the add button and you can display the website this One, okay, now we have successfully captured the display here. Yeah. You go to a video capture device to capture yourself here. Yeah. Create new and press OK. I already created that, so I don't have to right now. You can add games if you can capture here. Yeah. If you play any game, you will automatically capture the game here. Yeah. Next is image. You could click on image and browse here. You select the image here and press on OK. And the picture will be selected. You can resize the picture. If you want to crop your webcam or picture or video or anything, you can press the Alt key and hold hold the alt key and press the mouse button and you can able to crop this image if you click on the media source you can add a, add a video here you can browse any video and you can play on loop and browse any video for example if i select this video you can see the video is playing right now you can add a text to press on ok and you can select the font here and press anything from the text here and press OK and you can create the opacity to by clicking on the vertices here and opacity 50 you can do you can set opacity here This is for video capture. This is for window capture. You can capture any window here. Alright, let's go to the audio mixer. Audio mixer, you can, if you are using a laptop microphone, you should lower this desktop audio to minus 40 or 45. So that people can hear your voice. Here is a mic. Head on over to the setting here and click on filters and click on the press button here and set the suppression level to minus 30 decibel and noise scale to minus 32 and open threshold to minus 26. Set your setting to this exact. Hear your surroundings better. Close and And on the scene transition, you can cut or fail. Cut is just super fast, and fail is a little slower transition here. You can set the mid second to increase to increase the transition or slower. In the file, you you can see all your recordings here. If you want to record, just start recording, or if you want to stream, then click on start streaming. You can show all your recordings here. And if you want to bring up the set or state or twist it or this activity, you can press and then here's the set here. You can press this to another another monitor if you have a, if you have a second monitor like here. If 
you want to check out for update, you can say uh, update here. Let's hold, head on over to settings. In general, there is nothing much to do. It, yes, it is here. You can change the theme here. I like the dark mode, so I set it to dark. You can stream on this or YouTube channel or Facebook here. Just select the nearest server from your home here. Output. You have the simple or advanced. Here. You head on over to advanced and streaming here and use the control to CBR and encoder to S264. If you are streaming on to 40p, then use the bit app on that gate. If you are streaming on 360p, then use the 700 kilobits per second. If you are streaming on 720p, then you should use up to 1000 kb per second. If you are streaming on 1080p, then you can set it up to 2500 kilobits per second. You can also google the bitrate for however quality you want to stream on. If you have a secondary microphone, then the microphone will be able to appear. I'm using the laptop microphone. This is the resolution of your screen. This is the output you want to stream on. Depending on the internet connection, you can choose any of this. If you are playing FPS game, then you should set it to 60. 60 FPS. Or if you are playing less intensive game, then you should set it to 30. I don't use hotkeys and advance to leave it as it is. Click on F9 and OK. And that's it. That's the end of the obvious tutorial here. Make sure you like and subscribe and for more future content.